Well, with the recent hike in interest rates, small business loans and lines of credit will be getting even more expensive, creating a hurdle for many rural entrepreneurs. Chris Pilkerson, Pilkerton, rather Chris Pilkerton, that is, with the Axion Opportunity Fund, joins us now to review some of the resources for these business owners. And Chris, thank you very much for your time here this morning. We appreciate it. So what are some of the challenges that our small business owners are going to be facing right now? Yeah, thanks for having me. You know, small businesses are facing rising costs, labor market dynamics, of course, supply chain constraints. Uh, and we hear a lot from, for example, our food business clients. And with the raising prices, it's really difficult for them with respect to, to ingredients. Um, you know, at the same time, access to capital to weather these challenges is really critical. We imagine Main Street, uh, an organization just came out with a survey that nearly half of small business owners would likely be unable to finance an unexpected $5,000 business expense. So that means a you know, busted refrigeration system or placing a delivery van really could put these small businesses out of employment and um, out of business, rather. And as you mentioned, uh, small business financing is really only going up um, with the interest rates. Now, talking about these interest rates, how is it going to continue to affect these small businesses as they move forward and try and sort of, I guess, get through the year? Right. Uh, well, you know, I think business owners are going to continue searching for some financing over the next few months, and they're obviously going to notice higher rates. Um, business loans often involve larger loan amounts, so they're going to see the impact of those higher rates more quickly than, than consumers who have, you know, more personal loan with smaller balances. Um, and business owners with outstanding loans are, um, they may see rates rise depending on, on the types of of loans, but they're also going to see credit cards with variable rates that are tied to prime. They're going to be going up as well. Uh, so it's really going to be a difficult time for these businesses. And one of the things that we're talking a lot about are programs like the Southern Opportunity and Resilience Fund, which is offering a fixed 4% fixed rate loan uh, until the end of the year. And that's for 15 different businesses or 15 different states located in, in the South area. So we really want to encourage folks to take advantage of those opportunities, as well as opportunities that Axion Opportunity Fund can provide both lending, uh, but also coaching and really providing that technical assistance that can help these groups really make it through this time period. All right, Chris, thank you very much for your insight today. Former head of the U.S. Small Business Administration, Chris Pilkerton, connecting with us. You can go online to find those resources, AO Fund dot org for more information. Thank you, Chris.